Hello Libras. This is your reading for the upcoming week. This reading is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. I hope all has been well with you guys with this whole coronavirus and COVID-19 and country shut down and all of that. Hmm. I feel like some of you are speaking your mind during this time. You're putting things out there in order to receive what it is that you guys are wanting to receive. And I feel like you're learning to speak up. You're learning to speak up. Use your voice here. I feel like a lot of you, um, you mute yourself sometimes for people. So I feel you guys are learning to speak up. What is the energy around Libras this upcoming week? What is the energy around Libras? The energy around Libras. Please show me the energy that's around Libras. Energy around Libras. What's the energy around Libras? Oh, come on. Talk to me. Energy around Libras. A lot. Let's see what that is. Transformation. Ending some, something that's not been working for you, Scorpio energy here. And I think that's that that um, safe zone of muting yourself, not to hurt somebody's feelings or not to rock the boat. I feel like you guys are stopping that. There's something definitely ending that should have ended a while ago, but um, here you are. You know? What is crossing Libras? What's crossing Libras? Please show me what's crossing Libras. What's crossing Libras? The moon energy. Cancer. Two majors right now. It's a huge shift going on around you. And it's pushing you. Okay, It's pushing you to dig deep. To see things clearly. To voice your concerns. To voice how you feel. Okay. To see through the fog. What is the underlying issue here for Libras? Underlying issue. Virgo energy here with that Hermit again. Another major, huge, huge, huge shift is going on. I think you are trying to figure something out and plan everything out before it actually, I'm, I'm trying to figure out the best way to work this. I feel like you guys are trying to explore every possible outcome before you speak on whatever it is that that you know you need to speak on I feel like you're trying to um, figure out what's gonna happen if I say this or what if I do this then this could possibly happen it's like you are um, isolating yourselves because you don't want to say the wrong things I feel I feel like you've been in your shell too long and you've been holding back. <clears throat> what was going on in the recent past for Libras? Recent past. Queen of Cups. Very loving. Um, very considerate. Taking it easy on people. Treading lightly being somebody's rock. I feel like you guys don't feel like somebody has been there for you as much as you have been there for them. Hmm. Crowning thoughts for Libra. Ace of Wands, you just want to start anew. Ace of Wands is a spark. Maybe something has gotten kind of um, lackluster. 
and you feel like you need to speak on this you need to tell somebody how you feel you need to tell them how you want to be treated and what you will and won't um, take from them tell them how you want to be loved I feel like somebody has dropped the ball here in your situation <coughs> excuse me what's coming in for you is a four of swords this is your energy this energy of removing yourself and it's like the hermit because I don't feel like you have completely come to grips with the fact that you need to speak up you need to speak up it's time it's time to see things clearly it's time to speak your peace it's time to let people know when they step on your toes it's time but I see you kind of staying in this mode of I need to really weigh you know what could possibly happen if I say this if I move like this what could possibly happen it's like you've got uh, four or five different scenarios and you're trying to figure out the best way to maneuver um, so it won't be so crushing to you or to the other person I feel here but I feel like something is hurting you I feel like you don't know how somebody truly feels about you there are truly like ambiguities that you're trying to navigate by yourself and figure out how is Libra viewing this situation the Knight of Swords comes up again you feel like you need to speak you feel like you have a lot to freaking say I feel aggravation coming from you guys I feel like this this anxiousness this anxiety of wanting to release I feel like you guys are about to burst what is the influence here for Libras the devil there's a lot of attraction to this person I feel like there is a level of codependency with this individual um, that is Capricorn energy there I feel that um, uh, you're in your safe zone and this is something that you're used to doing is kind of keeping quiet to not rock the boat but when you do that people tend to walk over you look over you do what they want with you if you don't speak up hopes or fears for Libras hopes or fears for Libras hopes or fears for Libras please show me the hanged man that you won't have to do anything and that will fix itself your hope is that whatever is meant to be will just be without you having to do anything Piscean energy here You're hoping that the situation fixes itself. Hmm. That this person may see at some point that um, they're doing you an injustice in some way. Then we have a Ten of Cups here that flipped over. You guys just want to be happy. You want to be emotionally fulfilled. You want that ultimate relationship here. Hmm. What is the outcome here for Libras? What is the outcome for Libras? What is the outcome? Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles. I feel like you are in a committed relationship and you will remain in a committed relationship there's something about the emotional connection that is bothering you 
something in regards to the emotional connection um, that is kind of um, is weighing on you because there is a committed relationship here finances seem to be great um, but there's something lacking in your opinion hmm, Virgo energy there um, you have Pisces here Capricorn uh, Scorpio Cancer energy in your reading. Alright guys, so that is what I have for you and I'll be speaking with you guys soon.